time to exit China? China is facing an exodus of not just foreign companies, but also Chinese companies like Alibaba and TikTok. An embattled China, which is already at its wit's end on how to check the exodus of foreign companies from the world's factory, is now facing a new crisis. Not just American or Japanese companies, but even Chinese companies like Alibaba and TikTok are looking beyond the dragon in order to embrace the realities of a post-coronavirus world. The global backlash against China has forced TikTok to make cosmetic changes and give itself a makeover. Meanwhile, on the other hand, Alibaba has been spending heavily on donations and humanitarian aid to find favor with the rest of the world. One distinctive feature of Chinese companies is the close ties that they maintain with the Communist Party of China. It is not possible to do business in China without the blessings of the CCP. Every Chinese firm posing as a private company is actually an asset of the CCP. And in the case of tech companies like Huawei, TikTok and Alibaba, this translates into an inherent security risk for other countries. TikTok, for example, was preempted by many as a dangerous platform during its nascent stage itself as it got reduced to a political tool of the CCP. However, in recent times, particularly in the backdrop of the global outrage against China for its obvious complacency and the cover-up of the COVID-19 outbreak, TikTok is looking to distance itself from the Chinese regime. As calls for boycott of Chinese goods get louder, TikTok doesn't want to be identified as a Chinese app and therefore it is trying to give itself a global makeover by roping in Kevin Mayer, former streaming chief at Walt Disney, as the CEO of TikTok and the COO of parent company ByteDance. With this, the CCP-affiliated app TikTok wants to tell the world that an American executive is now handling the video-sharing social networking app. TikTok owner ByteDance has quietly made a series of moves to transfer global decision-making and research capabilities out of China in the last few months. Not just TikTok, but another leading Chinese company, Alibaba, is trying to distance itself from the Xi Jinping regime, albeit in a subtle manner. Jack Ma co-founder of the Alibaba Group and the richest communist in the world, also happens to be a CCP member. In the past, he had said that he would happily hand over all his businesses to the party if it so desires. But now Alibaba might be trying to distance itself from the CCP. The e-commerce and internet giant has been trying to earn the world's goodwill at a time when Beijing's goodwill and credibility is at an all-time low. The conglomerate has donated millions of dollars in medical supplies and other humanitarian aid to all parts of the world, India, Latin America, the United States, and Africa. Jack Ma's foundation is donating masks, ventilators, and other medical equipment to countries around the world. Jack Ma even said, No single country can handle this crisis independently during an online seminar organized by his Foundation for African Doctors to interact with Chinese experts. Jack Ma has donated 1,000 ventilators to New York apart from millions of masks to all parts of the world. In fact, when the pandemic was still in its early stages of the month of January, Jack Ma had pledged $14 million for developing the COVID-19 vaccine. Such donations coming from a Chinese conglomerate were rather unusual given the fact that philanthropy in China has always been more domestic than global. According to Edward Cunningham, a research of Chinese philanthropy said that philanthropy has grown in China as its economy flourished over the past few decades, but the donations have been focused on China or on foreign universities with family connections to donors. So why is Jack Ma suddenly trying to help the world amidst the coronavirus pandemic? The fact remains that Alibaba wants to give a loud and clear message to the rest of the world. That is, the Xi Jinping regime has slipped the world into a pandemic, but Alibaba is trying to help the world. Through global philanthropy and image makeovers, Chinese firms want to dissociate themselves from the CCP. China's mass diplomacy too has boomeranged and Beijing hasn't been able to project itself as the savior of the world. So Alibaba started a mask diplomacy of its own, independent and separate from the Chinese government. 
the coronavirus pandemic and China's alleged involvement in aggravating the health crisis has driven a deep wedge between China and Chinese companies. The results of being too close to the CCP are for everyone to see. Telecom giant Huawei tried to use its ties with the CCP for promoting itself across the world, but its 5G technology is now being rejected nearly everywhere. And therefore, Alibaba and TikTok do not want to go down the same path as Huawei. They want to distance themselves from the CCP and abandon Beijing amidst the ongoing pandemic.